Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to embed your Twitter feed onto your website. It's a real simple process. So if you have a website and you'd like to have a live stream of your Twitter feed running on it, it's very easy to do. So we're going to do that with our site here and then we're just going to embed it on a test page using Google Sites. So the method for embedding is going to vary depending on how you're creating your website. Google Sites is pretty easy. And actually we're going to have a book out on this in a couple of weeks called Google Sites Made Easy on Amazon. So look for that if you're interested in learning how to use Google Sites. All right. So anyway, so we have our, our Google, or excuse me, our Twitter feed here and we want to embed it onto this site here or this page. So what we need to do is all we have to do is copy the URL for our Twitter page and go to this site which I'll put in the description published.twitter.com paste it in here and click the little arrow and then we're going to pick an embedded timeline and then it gives you the code here so we just copy the code then we're going to go back to Google Sites here and we're just going to double click to bring up the uh, a little wheel menu here and we're going to pick the embed option and we're going to put in the embed code not the URL but the embed code and then click on next and then it shows this little preview here and we just click on insert and then we have it on our page here and so with Google Sites you could simply you know if you want to make it bigger or smaller you could do that just keep in mind it might not look too exciting if you make it too big it might blur things out so then we want to preview it we just go up to the little preview button here and then you can see we could scroll down and look at all of our Twitter posts here just like if we were on the uh, Twitter site itself but we're doing it from within our website and then this will update live as you you know post more stuff on Twitter it will update your website as well so it's a pretty nice feature, pretty simple to use. So like I said, just go to your Twitter page, copy your site URL, go to this Twitter publish page, paste it in there, get the code, and then just however, whatever kind of web website design you're using, just you know use the embed option, paste it in there, and then you could uh, kind of, you know, if you want to resize it, if you don't like it that big, you could make it smaller and let's say move it in the center. Let's see what this looks like. That type of thing. So yeah, you just play around with it and see what works for you. All right, pretty simple. Give it a shot. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.